from the deposits of Steinkopf in the Northern Cape of South Africa. This is an extremely interesting piece. Um, now, typically the ones from Steinkopf would be a little bit more smoky, a little bit more grayishness or greenishness to them. Now, in this case, there seems to be a mild coating of some iron oxides or girthite on some of these faces. But to add insult to injury, we've, we've actually, this is a floater. I want to show you crystallization going right around and there we have crystallization too on this whole section here. Now uh, from a display point of view this is quite quite magnificent but what mainly comes to mind on the Steinkopf quartz is they are after all the, the so called Orange River quartz one of the many species actually the Orange River quartz in itself is a collectible uh, a mineral line or, or a crystal even line of quartz uh, there are so many different versions in the deposits of the Northern Cape of South Africa. And I think the more you, you magnify, the more you'll actually see. Like in this one, which appears milky to clear with, with a little bit of a grayish undertone. Please note that I am a bit color challenged. So if you don't see it, it's not there. Um, from Steinkopf, Northern Cape of South Africa, about 60, kilo, 60 kilos north of the town of Springbok. Um, in, in, uh, uh, as we head towards the, the west coast of South Africa. That lovely piece. And of course, wood stand flat like this, and all the way around like that. Then of course, crystallization around the back as well. Well, totally a floater as is.